Curacao. I think I'm pronouncing that correctly. I'm gonna call this video a day, a day in Curacao because that's all we have, a day in Curacao. And it's actually uh, just a, a few hours actually where we're just gonna walk around the town a little bit and check it out. I'm sure you could do all kinds of other fun stuff like jet skis and uh, ATVs and snorkeling and all kinds of stuff, but we didn't do anything like that. We are just going to check out the town I hear there's a floating bridge that we can walk around, um, maybe get lunch somewhere, and uh, I don't know, just have a good time. Are you by yourself? Or yeah. you? I've got the rest of my family with me. They're in the back. How about this Pete's Travel Vlog? Pete's Travel Vlog, Pete's Day in Curacao. Are you going to be in my video, Pete's Day in Curacao? Yes. Okay, good. Because I am your daughter. Okay, good. Yes, you are. So we're in this fort area, which is also, uh, they made it into a shopping mall, which is pretty cool. But they have a nice little um, observation point up at the top here. And uh, it's a great spot for, for pictures. And to eat ice cream. Right, Emmy? Yeah. All right, good. Um, so let's check it out over here. Oh, this is nice. What do you think? That over there is the acclaimed floating bridge. So we're going to go over there. And I think they opened that bridge up on when there are boats that come by. So you have to be off it when the boats come by. Or it could get a little wet. What is it? What do you see over here? This is just like a window without the glass. We've made it over to the floating bridge. Now, we do have to keep in mind that it uh, there could be a ship that comes by here. And if they start playing, if they start sounding a horn or something, then we have to hurry up and get off, okay? Signal. Better hurry up. Let's go. Yep, they're okay, they're raising it now. Well look at this. Look at that, they're actually moving it. Guys, we just made it off. They're moving it. Well, it looks like they just moved the bridge to the side. I thought it was going to be like a drawbridge type situation, but I guess not. Some people stayed on the bridge. Did you know that? Yeah, I saw that. I guess they just gave up trying. Yeah. We should have stayed on there. That would be cool. There's a bunch of these little alleyways here which have stores and restaurants and cafes and all kinds of stuff on it. So, it's a really fun spot to explore, isn't it? Yeah, the colors are so pretty. It's yeah, the buildings and... Like a tropical Europe. Yeah, they're a really neat spot. Too bad we only have a day for me to explore Curacao. True. Do you know what time we have to be back? 4.30 or something. Did you no. check? Yes. Okay. Is that for your Instagram account? Yeah. See it on M's Big World. M's Big World. Hashtag Funda Wings. What is it? Funda Wings. Oh. Yeah. Funda Wings. We'll see if we can find it. All these little streets have so much cool stuff. I don't know why they have tourist information there, they should just ask me. 
Well, you have spent almost a day, well, yeah. hours here, so yes. you're now in Croca. A day in, a day in Curacao with Pete. I spent a Croca. That's what I used to think it was called. I don't remember that. That maybe, so it's your fault. Yes. Oh, look, they have one of those things where you can hang your... Oh, yeah. Box of love. We're back on the floating bridge. Hopefully there are no boats that try to pass while we're on it this time. But it was cool because it just slid over. I, I think I was expecting it to open up. Yeah, I thought it was going to be like a drawbridge, but yeah, they just moved it to the side. Really pretty cool. Oh my gosh, this thing really rocks. And and at night, at night it's supposedly it's great, oh, but yeah, all the lights. I think we can see it from our room. We'll just take pictures. Yeah. That's a pretty big bridge over there, too. Yeah, no, that's a bridge. Well, that's a bridge. Yeah. The architecture and the buildings are really, really interesting here. It's so a, it's a cross develops. between yeah, it's a cross between Europe and the Caribbean. Yeah, that's exactly. It. I definitely really nice feel to it. Mix, you think uh, so? Yeah. Would that be your take on it? Everyone's very nice to us too. That's like a big thing. Like very helpful, very nice. Right. Everyone offers you tours and stuff, but they're not like aggressive. No, not, like, not okay. bad. Yeah. Have a good day. They have questions. a bunch of uh, vendors and things out here with some neat things to sell. Lots of places to eat, like really cute ones with like little stops in the middle of the streets to kind of sit. We bought a uh, what did we buy? Magnet. Just a, a magnet, some t-shirts and oh, stuff. Oh yeah, girls got t-shirts. Yeah, so not big spenders today, but it's okay. What are you gonna I... do with a Curacao t-shirt at home? <laughs> Well, they want them. Yeah, no, okay. They'll wear them in Alaska. Okay, are you going to wear it in Alaska? I don't know when we're going to Alaska, but... We went last summer, so that's still in my mind. Okay. There's even more shops over here. How cool is that? Fun with Pete, Pete and Curacao. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Pete's crazy Curacao adventure. <laughs> yeah. We've got all kinds of potential titles for this video, but <laughs> hopefully you enjoyed it. Obviously, it was just a kind of top-level sneak peek of the island. I'm sure there's a lot more to it than what we showed you today, yeah, but don't just come for a few hours. Yes. Yeah. There's a lot more. Yeah. Like, rent the car, go on a tour. We'll have to come back but, someday. Yeah, definitely. I would love to explore more, but it was still pretty cool, right? It was. Yeah, we had a great time, and uh, people were friendly. It's a really, really unique place, and can't wait to come back. And it's the, build, the buildings are beautiful. They yeah, are. And the water is so pretty, so maybe we can show them. It is, now. yes. Yep. All right. Well, thanks for watching.